I'll tell you what, you know, life can be hard in nature. I mean, especially for a caterpillar. So that caterpillar is not dead. I promise you, it's not dead. You see, that's a parasitoid wasp. And what she's done is she stung it to paralyze it. And well, you can see the hole. You can only imagine what's going to happen next. And there it goes. Now after dragging that paralyzed caterpillar down the hole, she's going to bury it. First with a few pebbles, and then she's going to throw some sand over it, and eventually she's going to bury it alive. Now, there's a reason why she doesn't kill the caterpillar. You see, she laid her eggs in it, or egg. And what's gonna happen is that egg is going to hatch and the little baby wasp is going to eat that caterpillar from the inside out. And even more insidious, it's gonna avoid the vital organs, keeping it alive right up until the last moment when it becomes an adult, emerges from that caterpillar and finally killing it, and then out comes an adult wasp. And now, of course, you know, being buried alive. That reminds me of this really cool scene in Star Trek II where Khan tells Kirk, I've done far worse than kill you. I've hurt you, and I wish to go on hurting you. And I shall leave you as you have left me, marooned for all eternity in the center of a dead planet. And just like our caterpillar, buried alive. Nature is brutal.